Previously in The Sims 2, PSP would arrive in Dead Tree so that we can look for Isaac Rosen's wife. Robotic wife at that. So now, let's go back to the regular Let's Play. Good day guys and girls, I'm Bayman Command and I deeply apologize for not updating for two weeks. I swear to God, really, life really wants to screw me over. The first week was I had to work on a script. I think I... No, I didn't mention that last week because I didn't record, right? The second one... My PSP is malfunctioning. Oh, shit. Okay, thank God. Whew. I thought it was going to reset again. The, the reason why my PSP malfunctioned was really no reason. Just wanted to die out on me. That's why I'm, I'm really worrying when it's when it's freezing like that, even in the loading screens. Even here when it's when the light is flashing, I am deeply worried. It might cr it might just crash on me. So previously we talked this to Hazel's ex fiance and Lady Cashier. Oh, trash! Lady Cashier over here, so that we activated two of the missions now. Okay. Now, actually, we talked to the journalist in the abandoned library. Not really abandoned, just old library. Excuse me? Don't shout, man. That's rude. You're disturbing the peace. Wait. Why do you still have that exclamation mark on your head? Maybe I haven't talked to you yet. Or didn't save. I don't know. Let's see. What do you have to say, Mr. Roland? Yeah, I didn't really all the time that sounds you don't recognize me do i know you yes we all have we i think we did but let me just go through this again the kind society kind society i don't know if we really have to pronounce it like as kind or keen society i don't know I haven't asked people who play this game yet i don't even know anyone who plays this aside from people on the internet the kind or i'm gonna say keen society Though it's it it's gonna be wrong. Let's say I do buy your pamphlet. Now what? What kind of mysteries? Yada yada yada. Okay, okay, I'll buy it. It's highway robbery because I'm a snob. Fine, here you go. I hope so, cause it's worth fifty simoleons. Okay, so I think I haven't activated the. The quest for the journalist guy, but you already know. I think I, I didn't save. I think, but I'll activate it after I go here to the Night Scowl Saloon. I think that was the right name for this place. And this video might be cut short in in a while. It's gonna, it's gonna be very short, a shorter um length because ooh hello, whore, because my. My, ca my camera, not my camera. I'm not recording this on camera, people. This is Remote Joy and Cam Studio. If you're very curious, because I've received a lot of messages from that. Okay, so this is the guy's bathroom. Yes, it is. So, the video might be a little shorter than usual because my computer's memory is a little bit on the down low. Which is kind of irritating when that happens. So, let's see. Oh! Oh, here is someone who wants to talk to me. Hey, feller. Oh, nice. Nice beard and stash combination you got there. Especially the white hair. Yeah. Really rocking it, dude. Wanna get. Ooh! Secret. Howdy, partner. Welcome to the Night, night, night Hell. I didn't. So it's Night Hell, not Night Scowl. Okay, Night Hell Saloon. Nice place you got here. Why, thanks. I'm who? And my little sister over there? That's Annie. Which one? The girl with the pigtails and the straw colored hair. Can't miss her. Seems like you're getting good business. Mind if I invest some of my moolah in your joint? You kidding? This place has been a ghost town ever since the night beast showed up. And you've been out outside at night. There's this monster that runs around scaring the heck out of people. You don't say. You know, I'd give you just about anything to see that monster gone. 
Really? How much? Well, you gotta find out who it is. Monsters like that, they don't come out of nowhere. Okay. Now, somebody in this town is turning into that thing. Thing. You gotta find out who. And how do I exactly do that? And where's that? Oh, that one. Huh. Looks like a... Oh no, that's a guy. Okay. Excuse me. Go out there and look for the night beast. Figure it out. Then what? You, then you track him down, track down the person you think it is, and try to make him mad. See if they transform in front of you. You seem to know a lot about monsters, man. Do you work for Discover the Discovery Channel or Sci-Fi? I don't know, something, some channel that or cable company that has a show that goes on and on and on about the supernatural. Oh, that, that that's the girl. Okay, the one that I called a whore. Sorry. I might hit on you later. Comes with the territory. So, best way to make someone mad, I think, is to zap it with something. Zap them with what exactly? Like, uh, one of those tasers you see on TV. Where do I get a taser? If you got a workbench, making one is the easiest thing in the world. Go check it out. I'll do that. Great. Well, if you manage to find a knife piece and expose him for all the world to see, yeah. I just might give you something. Well, that just sounds like a good proposition to me. Don't be a stranger neither. Come talk to me later and you might you can join our line dancing town. Ooh, line dancing? My favorite. And if you don't, ooh, let's just pick up that secret before I forget about it. The line dancing competition he's talking about is that karaoke, that jukebox over there. We have to, uh, secrets of biology first. Biologists have synthesized a flower that adheres perfectly to principles of Feng Shui. Lovely. I don't even believe in that. Okay, so this is the line dancing turn on. Okay, fine. We're gonna... Okay, now we have activated the one of the missions out here. Okay, can I walk now? Thank you. Wait, wait, wait. I saw a symbol over there. Aha, uh -huh, no. Fudge. Sure, why not? Let's dance. We're gonna see if we can explain what's been happening here. So, Dead Tree isn't own, isn't like uh, a spirit to his, the area around a spirit to a state where those ones have the domestic problems and the evil scientist stuff. Dead Tree is more of like a supernatural hub for the, for the world of The Sims. See, we already got um, a cemetery, a cult, um, a guy that transforms into a night beast, and a journalist. Yeah, very creepy, I know, really. Okay, now we're gonna go see if the... I'm not really sure how... Uh, this is where the part of the game that really irritated me. I'm gonna hit on one of these girls. I'm not gonna hit on a chair, man. <laughs> That's absurd. Why, why should I hit on a chair? Really? I'm just gonna chat up with this girl for a moment or so. Then I'm gonna intimidate that other guy that's dancing like a numbnut. You know, packing your own stuff is quite an ordeal, lady. Have you even tried it? Going to space with your own package is really hard. Yeah, just ask, ask the astronauts. I don't think they even bring a lot of stuff when they go to space. Just themselves. And probably books too since it's gonna be a pretty long ride up and down orbit. Yes. Okay, dokie. I'm gonna... Yeah, that guy's dancing. What the heck? Dancing. No, I don't want to look at the chair. Stop looking at the chair, dude. Make someone cry. Okay, I'm gonna make someone cry. Damn it. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. fine. Okay, so this lady over here is playing the piano. That's the women's bathroom. There's nothing much else we can do around here. I think we can... 
I don't think we can sell the... Oh wait, we have to talk to him first so that we can inquire about the... Oh, we can sell secrets to him too, I forgot. We got the, jur the journalist and him can accept secrets. Though they prefer different ones. You said something about a line contest? Line dance contest, because a line contest would be very, very boring. Yes, indeed. We got a, fi a fine set of line dances in the world right here. Really now? If you think you can best one of them... Uh oh, see, there's the there we go. Sign me up. Will do. So this is to be the job here around Dead Tree. We will do that in the next part. I'm sorry if this is going to be a very short, short part, but my computer is acting like a bitch. I'm sorry, but... I really have to contend with it first. I have got to de delete some things and stuff. So guys and girls, thank you for watching. I hope I have guided you into another part of The Sims 2 PSP. Until then, I'll see you next time. Say groovy.